a cute top is easy to spot, right? But the bottom half of your outfit is where things can sometimes get tricky between fluctuating trends, silhouettes, and fluctuating waistlines too. My first guest says women struggle to pick the right pair of pants. In today's style file, we're helping you identify the right fashion staples, shop your closet, and rethink what you already have. Studio 5 style and fashion contributor Casey Matheny is here to share what she calls the essential list of pants that every good wardrobe should include. This, these are the gotta have. Gotta have them. Yep. And you can style them a lot of different ways. Do these pants, though, work for every body type? Because that's one of the trickeries of this, yeah. is finding pants that feel good on my body. For sure. So these are all kind of the, the basic pieces. You can choose whatever leg line that you want that will mm. accentuate your features best. Um, and, and But yes, it's more just the idea behind each one. I love that you're putting in this into essentially a shopping list for us, so we can shop the closet first, see what we have, yes. and then maybe eye what we might invest in to have that complete what we need sort of a wardrobe later. Yes, and there was one of these which I will have to, I will have to tell you about. Confessional. I, it is. Yep, it's a confessional. <laughs> I'll, I'll get there when we get there. All right, tailored trousers okay. are first. And these may feel, Casey, a little fussy or buttoned up, no pun intended, for the average everyday mom, woman on the ground. Okay, so these are from Gap. Okay. They are just a neutral tailored trouser. They have an elastic waistband, but they look so much nicer than, than the effort you have to put into so them, they're right? they're gonna like move the with me, they're gonna bend with me. Yep, yep, and they are so versatile. So one tip that I have when getting these trousers mm -hmm. is to get a more neutral color. Mm. Invest in that neutral color, um, because bringing in a brighter, more colorful one can be tricky. A brown or a black is gonna be really easy to mix and match with, mm -hmm. but you're gonna find that you can wear heels with it, or mm. nice loafers to dress it up, or often I'll just wear these with white sneakers. Okay, so we can dress it down that much. 100%, yes. With the sneakers or the t-shirt. Yeah, which is also very current right now to wear that trouser look. Mm -hmm but more dressed down. And when we say tailored trousers, go style nerd on us just a little bit. What tailoring okay. details are we looking for that will make this a classic in our in our closet? Right, so one that we're seeing a lot of right now are the pleats, Yeah. which some women are like, I do not want pleats. I don't need I extra. Don't, <laughs> yeah, I don't either, but these are a flat pleat, okay. so they're gonna lay nicely against your tummy as well, uh -huh. and aren't going to bring any attention or eyes that way. Okay. They just, it's just part of the trouser look. Essential pant number two is a dark denim, to which yes. I say, is there any other color? I haven't been able to like jump on the light wash. <laughs> it's funny you say that, because this is the pant. I look through my clothes and I'm like, <gasps> I only have light colored denim, but I- You didn't have I, dark? No, I well, because uh -huh. they were all skinny. I had so many, and when I said goodbye to skinnies, they were all dark and I have had this hole in my closet and it was a dark wash <laughs> denim. Uh, so yes, I do feel like I have had the hole, it has been real. Get yourself a dark wash because they will act just as, a de they're mm -hmm. a denim, but they just look a little bit nicer than a lighter wash. A little more dressed up, a little more yep. polished. And I think actually your personal story illustrates a good one because certain silhouette trends come and go. Like the skinnies, they came for a long time. Yes, we got really time. acquainted, mm -hmm. uh, now they're gone. So it kind of speaks to what you said a couple of minutes ago, which is to shop your body when it comes to these classic yes. pieces, right? Yes, 100%. I have like stocked up, I love the straight leg pant. And for most women, that is the most flattering, a straight mm -hmm. or kind of a boot cut or demi boot. Yeah. So, um, know your body and know what's going to flatter it. And I never once looked at someone who was actually taking that good advice during mm -hmm. the whole skinny jean movement and thought she looks off. Like there's something about a classic pair of jeans that does fit your body right, that is always going to be in style or yeah. on trend because it works for you. It's so true. Yeah. yeah, it's so personal. And then my tip with these is I love doing a Canadian tux. Look at you. Yep, yep, so the denim on the dem denim is just a fun classic way to wear. Wear some dark wash. It's not just Jay Leno anymore. We no. can all embrace the Canadian no. tuxedo. Yeah, I love it. I love that. All right, essential pant number three, a good pair of leggings. Okay, a good pair of leggings, yes. And I would even level that up one more and say a pair of leggings that have something interesting to it. So okay. one thing that we're seeing a lot of right now are these slits down here that face in the front. Mm -hmm. um, maybe it's zippers or maybe a different material. Maybe it's a more leathery material. But take your black leggings, and if you want, 
Je them up a little bit. I think that's no. awesome advice because for anyone who's lived through a pair of maternity black leggings that were all <laughs> that was all you all you wore. Yes. In my case, for like five, four years in a row, I think the idea of an extra detail like the zipper or like the flare or the leather makes it feel a little more purposeful and a little yes. less from. And they look more like a trouser mm -hmm. than your legging that you're going to wear to the gym. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So one other little tip yeah. is when I'm wearing leggings, I like to have my bottom covered. So whether that yeah. is with Please. a trench or yeah, a longer blazer or a longer sweater, try to cover up your bottom. She was very polite about it. I, it's one of my pet peeves. When I just see a tush. Yeah. I just, yeah. come on. It's, it's, it's a, yeah. yeah. Yep. All right, enough said. I'll <laughs> yep, stop there. get it. Casey stopped me and I'm grateful she did. Uh, this next look is my favorite of the day. It's just <sighs> so lovely, the to kind of the yeah. tonal look. What's the pant, the essential pant we're talking okay, about? Okay, so the essential pant here is some sort of leather pants. Really? Which, when I think we hear leather, it sounds rocker and it sounds hard edgy. and edgy. Yeah. But like, these are from J. Crew. They are the most beautiful pink, and I could see anyone of all ages wearing this. I am kind of surprised that a leather pant made your essential list. Yeah. Well, yeah. I yeah. mean, we know you, and this is yes. so lovely and so elegant. I mean, it kind of is an elevated look, right? It is, and with things being more straight leg, -like, so many body types, can pull this off. Like this is this whole outfit is actually from J. Crew. I mm. cannot wait to wear it. I have not yet. Well, I'm obsessed with the tonal. Yeah. yeah, like go into a store, try them on. Right? Yeah. Even if you need help in the store, being like, what would you pair with these? Like, go give it a try because it is it is young, but it's fun and and, and everyone can wear it. Okay. You I'm, can gonna, I'm gonna take your encouragement on yeah. that. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna get it. Okay. Uh, fifth and final corduroy. <gasps> okay, corduroy is back, which makes me happy because when I was 14, I wore a lot of corduroy and I loved it because it is stretchy, it is comfy, yeah. it is it is casual, but you know, not like as casual as leggings. I love it too. I love a good corduroy. It kind of has a little prep to it. Totally. Yes. Unless you're Brooke in the seventh grade and I wore corduroy, lime, green, overalls. Oh, yes, yay. I did. I did and I wore them on the day they were voting for peer leaders because I felt like yes. that would like, I'm president. Put me out there, vote for me and I, I, I won. So I think they worked in my favor. Good for you. <laughs> I love it. Yep, good for you. Where are these from? Okay, these are also from J. Crew. Cute. J. Crew is just a, sto a solid you know, yeah. option for that. I love that you've laid it out this way. The five essential pants every woman should have in her wardrobe. Where can we get more fabulous style advice from you? So always my Instagram at Casey Matheny Style. Lots of tips, tricks, everyday photos. I just want to help people feel comfortable in their everyday. That's it. Dressed. That's it. Helps you get dressed, but ultimately helps you feel more confident in who you are and the foot you're putting forward. Thank you, Casey. Yeah.